Kitty, please don't step on my recording equipment. I will be very sore if you mess something up. Because I know you know you're not supposed to be climbing. Don't you yawn at me! I wish you guys could see this sassy cat right now. She knows exactly that she's doing something she's not supposed to be doing. Cats are smart critters. Ah, uh, but anyway. Let us continue onward. Whoops! Okay. Let us continue onward. To more dynamite gameplay. How we doing anyway? Ah, uh, we've got destroy the eco crystals, explore the dark cave, wherever that is, and get the rest of the scout flies. Only 20 orbs left, which I'm going to guess means I didn't miss anything in the other areas. Because we just gotta go this way now. I'm gonna guess. Uh, probably need to go grab a charge over here. Alright. Stay on target. Jack, why are you looking down? There it goes. Control is being a little weird there. And yeah, pretty sure you noticed, but uh, Dark Ego Crystals explode. So do you if you land in Dark Ego. And there are a couple you need to get near in order to break them. I guess we could have technically taken that one out physically. Couple paths here. But that way is definitely the way we want to go first. Oh, steel crates. Missy. Hey, kitty. Get down. Mm, just casually stretch and walk away, sure. I am of no concern to this cat. Alright, let's grab a charge, see if we can get to those... Those there, uh... Steel crates. A couple well-placed long jumps. Can I get them from here? My control stick seems to be jerking downward. There it goes. I don't know what it is. Oops. Oopsies. I done it. I exploded. I'm sorry for exploding too much. Sometimes you can't help it. And there we go. Now, go for a little swim. Run away! That crystal's gonna blow! No kidding. We've seen several of them explode already, Dax. You don't need to remind me when something explodes. An explosion is something you remember. But that wasn't the last Dark Ego Crystal. So, I feel like I have missed one. Probably not good. Don't let the lights go out. Oh, get out of here. Yeah, welcome to the dark cave. Not a particular fan of this area. The one good thing is, is when you kill the big spiders, they stay dead. Even between lives. Well, it makes things a little less problematic. Because, yeah, probably gonna be falling to my death a little here. Little spiders come back. Ow! That was no fun. 
It still amuses me to no end that the long jump counts as an attack in this game. Oh my yada. Take that. <coughs> Pardon me. Ah, wait, here's the last dark eco crystal, I'm pretty sure. I thought there was another one in the water somewhere. I think that was the last dark eco crystal. Yup. Because now there is a random power cell here. So, take care of took care of that one. Hey there, Scout Fly Crate. That was not affected by the lack of light, and I could see you fine. Thank you for the another power cell. Alright. Now, we get to move around, possibly in the dark, around moving platforms. And falling platforms. Ain't that a hoop. But you can thankfully keep the lights on if you keep smacking them. It does reset their little light timer, I guess. Boy, it gets dark. Well, almost out of here. that and power cell three more eggs and those weren't the last ones oops I'm somewhere there I go hmm there's six eggs somewhere I don't like that There they are. I missed them in Spiderland. There we go, Spider Cave. Oh yeah, also important to note, this would have been plugged, I guess. So you really need to do the Snowy Cave first here. Anyway. Let's get out of the Spider Cave in this Spider Cave. And head back Perfect. Perfect ending to this area. Because, yes, now we have all of the power cells here. We have all 200 of the orbs, six of which we missed while flailing about that big spider pit. And we have the seven scout flies, giving us 98 of them. So, with that, we will not say goodbye just yet, because I've learned from my actions last a couple times, and am going to head right over to the next Zoomer segment. Uh, because that is the last area branching off of the volcanic crater, there are only two direct ones directly connected to it. I guess the area after 
the zoomer segment counts as a third area because it is the last area of the game it just doesn't have a hub area connected to it then again it's got its own portal so I don't know your call does the volcanic crater technically have three areas or does it only have two we'll find out in a moment Because I am going to be right back. Just going to take a quick pause here. And we'll move right on to the... What's this place called? Lava Tube. So, see you in a bit. Alright, everybody. Here we go. Lava Tube time. Up uh, first, let's talk to Kira. Alright, before we head in, Lava Tube's mu more like the uh, first Zoomer segment. There's the cooling balloons, there's the heat gauge, and there's only two power cells to get. As well as 50 of our lovely eggs. And of course, one of the power cells is Scout Flies. So, let's get going. Oh, I gotta say this is probably my favorite zoomer segment of the game, just because it's a little more varied. Oh boy. If not a little more perilous. You'll see what I mean by varied in a little bit, I guess. Oh, missed an egg. Oh, missed more. Shoot. I am just all kinds of clumsy. Whoa, whoa, okay. Whoa, alright. Zoomer, come on, man. It hasn't been that long since I've driven you. I'm not that out of practice. Ah, I'm missing eggs all over. So, yeah, probably gonna have to make a trip back through here. Or not. We've got another chance, ladies and gentlemen. The egg hunt must go on. What if Daxter turned into an Easter Bunny? Then collecting all these eggs would have made sense. Not really. You know what? Not having that. Not having that one egg left behind shenanigans. Oh, and there's eggs over here too. Of course, hanging out over the lava probably isn't good for us. Well, hey, what can you do? There's a lava, lot of lava to hang around. Scout fly. Ah! I got greedy. I saw the eggs over there. But yeah, lava tube here is pretty intense. I mean, we are coming off from an active volcano, so it makes sense. Uh, I gotta make sure to grab the cooling balloons. We are kind of like an, on an artificial time limit. Now, this does kind of remind me of, uh, like... What's it called? Like, time trials? Oh, shoot. I need to try to make this a little more success shaped. This lava tube really isn't that big of an area. It's just 
I want to say it's really just this opening path here, the opening paths here that are all twisty turny and branching out. And you really, whoa. Really gotta watch what you're doing. And keep an eye out for eggs and scout flies. All right, good. That's already all the precursor orbs though. And now we've got a bit of a boss fight. Thankfully, our uh, heat gauge doesn't go up nearly that much in this area. But we're fighting a drill, I guess. I guess it's not really anything. But, well, that was a thing. It existed. Don't really know its purpose. Oh, we've got plenty of yellow eco to use. And scout flies to get. Whoa, okay. I don't think they're too sadistic here in keeping the scout flies on a lot of these platforms. But yeah, just look at how much stuff is going on in this zoomer segment. It's awesome. Whoa, scout fly crate. Hold on. There we go. Thankfully, I don't need to run into the scout flies and pick them up here. Ah! Oh no! Lava. Though so another interesting point about this is that there are checkpoints in this zoomer segment. Which is always fun. Uh, I'm surprised that didn't kill me. That did, but... All right, we can do this. I'm sure if I made this in one run, it would have been in a very exciting uh, zoomer segment. Like I said, I've actually been doing pretty good and looking fairly impressive, I guess, until the end of these. But what can you do? All right, one more scout fly somewhere. I think I've been missing that one, actually. Oh, out of eco, out of eco, out of eco, okay. It's, uh, nope, all right. Ah, the last scout fly was right there, too. Gotta make sure to hit the vents. I can do this, come on. You're not the boss of me. You think you can win? Zoomer segment, I'll show you. Now I'll show you, Rar. It's like a, the Sonic quote, Smash Brothers, I don't know. There we go. Shot the last scout fly in there somewhere and got the power cell. Now, we just gotta leave. is right there. Long jump. And one more power cell for the road. Lasers. Before we end this episode, though, even though we didn't do it the last couple times, let's activate the teleporter gate. Yep, we're at the end game, ladies and gentlemen. Right through that door is Gollum Maya Citadel. The last area of the game, and the last few power cells and precursor orbs to collect. 
So, with the lava tube complete, we are up to 96 power cells, 1800 precursor orbs, and 105 scout flies. The rest of our little collection adventure and the last six percentages are in that citadel. So for now, Sparky is signing off. I'll see you then.